Try and focus. There you go. Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new to the channel, my name is Big Ball Vlogs. I do reviews, news, everyday vlogging, and every once in a while, I'll do a tutorial. If this video is educational or somewhat entertaining, please consider smashing that like button and maybe subscribing to the channel for new videos when I post them. So last week, I was having some issues with the DJI Mavic Air 2. If you haven't seen that video, I'll put a card somewhere up here. And I was having some issues with the sensor. So I asked you guys whether or not you were experiencing these problems and what might I do to resolve them. And you came back with a great idea to do a calibration of the sensor. So in this video, I'm going to do a tutorial, a full tutorial on how to calibrate the sensors in your DJI Mavic Air 2. And these principles should apply to maybe all of your DJI drones. So there's a reason why you might want to do a calibration before your first takeoff, and that's because when you get these drones, they're boxed up, they're packaged, they're put in crates, they're jostled, bumped, dropped, thrown on your porch, and the sensors may have been knocked out of calibration. So not having calibrated sensors may lead to issues like flyaways, and for some reason, mechanical failures that end up with your drone at the bottom of a lake. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to calibrate all of your sensors, and we're going to make sure that we have calibrated sensors before we take off on our first flight. So let's get started. Start with calibrating our compass and our IMU. So what you want to do is you want to go into DJI Fly. You want to click on the three buttons in the top right corner, and you want to scroll down until you find the sensor section. We're going to start with compass, so we're going to click on that. We're going to click calibrate, and we're going to click start. And all you have to do in this is just follow the on-screen prompts until it tells you the calibration is complete. that calibration is complete we're going to go on and we're going to do IMU so we're going to scroll back down to sensors we're going to click on calibrate again we're going to hit start and we're going to follow the online prompts until the calibration is complete and be sure to follow these steps as seen on the screen so you get a proper calibration once the calibration is complete you should get the tones for the drone restarting and you should be good to go Next, we are going to be calibrating the optical sensors in your drone. Uh, in the DJI Mavic Air 2, you have front and rear optical, optical sensors, also bottom optical sensors. In order to do the calibration on this, we're going to need a tool, and that tool is called DJI Assistant 2. It is located on the DJI website. So all you have to do is go to the DJI website, go to the specific drone that you have. On the top black bar, you will find something that says Downloads, and then scroll down and you should find the Assistant tool that you need. Once you get the assistant tool, download it, do a normal installation like you would do any app, and then we'll get started from there. So to do this calibration, you do not need a remote control, but you do need a USB-C cable. You need a pretty long one, so I usually use the USB-C cable that came with my cell phone. Once you have the app installed, plug in the drone via the USB-C cable, power it up, and then launch the application. Once launched, the application should identify the drone that you have. Click on that icon and that will take you into the tools that you will need to do the optical sensor calibration. So we're going to scroll down to calibration and we're going to click on that. Once you click on calibration, you're going to get a four step tutorial on what you need to do to do a proper calibration. Be careful to follow these steps specifically because if you don't, you'll have to restart the steps in order to get a proper calibration. So once you got the tool all lined up and you're doing the calibration, simply follow the online prompts until the calibration is done. You'll need to do this twice for each sensor. It takes a little bit of time and a little bit of patience, but once you're done, you should have a proper calibration and your sensor should be ready for your first flight. Sensor calibration should be something that you should include in your drone maintenance or preventative maintenance schedule. I do it maybe every week or every five flights just to make sure everything's okay so I don't have any issues while I'm up in the air. So, hey, that's how you do a sensor calibration on the DJI Mavic Air. And again, this should apply for many of your DJI drones. Thanks for watching. Thanks for supporting the channel. I'll get back to you soon. Talk to you later. Bye.